Uh, we're gonna do this unboxing here. We got Bacon, who is uh, guarding the package. Hey, Bacon! And, um, yeah, we're gonna get into this and see, uh, see what we got. Okay, so now Pancake has decided to join as well as Bacon. That's Bacon right there, and Pancake. It's all sprawled out there. Um, I'm gonna check and see what we got. So, there's quite a bit of stuff on this order. I'm actually been really excited to see everything that's gonna be here. So, let's see what we got. I don't know. I think that's marker, but never a good sign when you see red stains on the inside of the box. <laughs> okay. So right off the bat, oh, it's all taped together really well. We have a uh, 30p Metallica here. It's gonna go on the side. This looks like. Let's see here. It's maybe the end of glory. I see one vial open. That's not very right. good, yeah, but. Some isopods in there. Yeah, 40 ml 40. I'm a little worried about that. Hmm. Or maybe it is loose. Maybe it was another one loose. Yeah, it's open. All right, we'll see in a second there. 40 ml 40. Of our adult here. Green bottle blue female. Again. Should be, yep. Hematalica female. And another Hematalica female. So this is what I'm really super duper excited about. Um, here we have 80 Therophosa Blondies. Um, they're all in these containers here. Um, True tea Blondies that we got. Um, super excited to get into this. I'm gonna start checking these out one by one, and uh, I'll be right back with you. Okay, so some of the more curious cats are away here, so we can check out these um, check out these green bottle blues here. Now I just have a few empty containers here, obviously not its home, but something so we could check it out a little bit better without her running all over the place. It's actually really hard to do to hold the camera. <laughs> get this apart at the same time because I don't want to stress her out. Oh yeah, there she is. She is just gorgeous. Clearing the lens off there for a second. Alrighty, and we have eight of these beauties to unpack right now. So these are the T Blondie. I don't think I have ever even um, seen or been near this quantity. There's 80 in here, um, which is just insanity to me. Uh, really excited about getting these into you know the community and the um, you know tarantula hobbyist. Um, so. Let's see, I'll pull one of them out here on camera so we can kind of see the size of them and how they're doing. And let me just push this back a little bit. Just grab a container. And we're going to set them in. Set this right here. Yeah. Yep, there they are. Actually, a really decent size. Let's see if we can get a little better focus. There we go. Set him in the cup for now. Let him relax. He's had a long journey. 
I'm gonna pack all these away in their homes a little bit later on. I just don't want them running around while I was going through them. Okay, so we got all kinds of stuff to go through. We got these tea blondie, we got these green bottle blue, the peanut talc, the females, the embephori, and uh, and then the peanut talc slings here as well. So we got quite a bit of work ahead of me. All right, see you guys later. So here we have our P. Metallica female. Sorry, I wanted to um, take her out of the vial um, with using both of my hands and not holding one hand on the camera, uh, just in case you know how quick these pokies could be sometimes, especially the Metallica, they're very photosensitive. So, but uh, we have two P. Metallica females. She actually kind of looks like she's freshly molted. Um, so we're gonna get her into a home and um, let her relax a little bit from her journey. Beautiful colors, absolutely beautiful. Well, here, got all of our big green bottle blue females, our P. Metallica females here. There's two of them. So these are all gonna go into bigger homes and uh, start to relax after the uh, long journey here. This one here is kind of a little chunky monkey, so she's going to be molten soon or who knows, but we're going to see what we can do. I've read uh, green bottle blues in the past before successfully, have a few egg sacs, so I'll try doing this again here in a colony of females, so I'm just going to be looking for males now. Um, yeah, I'm ready. Have a good one. Bye.